What's going on? This is Zach. I got a quick video for you guys because I got to head out in a little while. Uh, this is a very useful video. Um, I think a lot of people find use to it, and that's kind of what I'm pushing towards. Although the topic seems different. Uh, so basically, if you ever had a website like this for school where your teacher made you, you know, type the home row or whatever, you know, letters like this, or well, it doesn't really matter what. Um, you know how exaggerate how long it is you know I I just I know how to type fast but I just I hated sitting through this you know there's te test after test so I've uh, I got a solution to that and it's a script um, so basically here's the auto typing script I um I found the root of this online like the main part of it I edited it myself so I'm not gonna take credit for this script but I did uh, I did make my own changes to it so basically what what the script is saying is uh, when you hit this and you type in whatever it makes you want to type it tells Safari to open up so you hit enter it opens Safari in a two second delay it repeats it once so if you repeated it twice it would type all this stuff twice uh, the delay is three seconds by so which means it's three seconds before it starts and then it ends the repeat so we only have one repeat so it's it should be done there and then it says do you want to quit you could change that if you want you can make it say whatever you know I'll add some exclamation marks and you'll see that in the script or you'll see it when it comes up so basically uh, we want to highlight all this we want to copy come over here and paste it into here now I'm going to tell you guys that there's one issue with this. Uh, it's not really a bad issue, but it these first two letters here, it's going to get wrong. And that's because it doesn't put a space in. So you guys could actually mess with this yourself and make it so it doesn't do that. I think that if I, wherever that's at, if I put a space in there, it won't get the first two letters wrong. So right here. Zan's also. Okay, so if I put a space here, it should be okay. But then we'd have to put a space under Zomo or whatever that word is. Okay, so hit enter. It's going to go back by itself and it's going to type all that. It got those two wrong. It's just because of the way the spacing is, it doesn't hit the, it, it hits the space bar and it shouldn't or something like that. You guys can mess with it. Um, I know that you could fix that. Um, so we'll do another one real fast. You got to. You can't use Command C to copy it for some reason. So you actually have to hit the copy button. Just go in here and then uh, type it. <clears throat> and then uh, the three second delay, and there you are. So, like I said, it, it's uh, it's definitely pretty cool. Um, you got to mess with it a little bit. You could, like I said, you could get these first two letters right. Although it really doesn't make a it doesn't cause any problem um, so <clears throat> so we just got a thousand seven hundred and twenty eight words per minute on that typing uh, which is very fast so you you could do this to your own advantage if a teacher is gonna like check to see what your words per minute is I would consider you know hitting the first button waiting for that timer to go up to like 20 seconds and then using this script um, that'll just make your words per minute slower but you're still doing it pretty fast so that's pretty much it for this video um, I thought that I'd bring it to you guys because it is pretty cool and uh, I'll uh, hit you guys up later with another video